Well, I'm with Simon Nixon at the uh, end of a workshop uh, with Consumer Focus, uh, talking about uh, direct gov and uh, improvements to um, digital public services. What's your takeaway? What's, what should we follow up from these discussions? Well, I know now how direct gov can use Liz's report <laughs> in a way that perhaps it could previously not have seen. And I think uh, there are so many... The report itself has generated a lot of uh, interesting conversation today. Some fantastic insights come out of it, and I'm sure when Liz and the team break that down, I think there'll be some initiatives coming to direct go, some real work streams and projects, if you like, for the back of it. That's what I'd like to see. Um, and one thing that uh, didn't come up today, uh, which I would like to mention, um, is that DirectGov in a couple of days, the 31st of March, is going to launch across the website a crowdsourcing uh, application, if you like, to gather people's feedback on uh, information on DirectGov. So we're going to have a piece at the bottom of every page that says, tell us how useful this information was, and we're actively, <laughs> actively asking people uh, who read the site, read the pages on the site, to give us their comments and feedback. We're going to be taking that information into Direct Gov and acting on it every month with, with ch positive changes. Um, so part of what we talked about today is actually happening. Um, and hopefully the uh, insight we get from the customers on that scale will give us some, some uh, quick wins. Right.